It's Rob here, just having a chat about the Cannondale Synapse. Uh, as I wheeled it out of the office, I applied the brake a little. Uh, this has got disc brakes, and we got a little bit of a squeal out of it. And uh, we sort of looked at one another in the office and thought, OK, this could be one of the problems of disc brakes. However, once I plonked myself on the bike and started riding, uh, there was no such bother. Uh, evidently, it's just... Uh, a, you can uh, give the, the brake a slight touch when you're not on the bike and not, there's no real pressure applied and it, you can get a sound out of it but on the road didn't hear a thing. Um, as for the discs, I, I, the, I'm not a convert, I'm not going to be switching my bike in a hurry. Uh, I can see why people would like them. Um, they are interesting, it's a, it's a novelty concept, I mean not a novelty concept, they work very well. but. I feel that I can um, control my calipers pretty well. I like my road calipers. I don't overheat my rims at the moment. I don't have that luxury of 20 lo kilometre long descents. Um, and so I'm going to stick with what I've had for years and, uh, and not changing for a heavier option. Um, and a more complicated one to maintain. Uh, I know how to, to remedy a, a rear caliper or a front caliper, but uh, when it comes to hydraulics and fluids and all of that, it, it goes a bit beyond me. Um, and furthermore, when I was taking a fistful of lever, I could get at the skid, but it took less effort with any of the calipers that we've got on test in this issue. So that's one interesting thing to note. Going to the frame, I think the, the 2004 colour scheme is fabulous. I wish they kept it. Um, I really like a, a good old racing stripe. It, and uh, a bit of colour injected into the black makes it look fantastic. On the drops out, dropouts, there's a touch of blue and red, and it's neat. Um, I like the, the retro 71, indicating Cannondale's year of inception. Um, and there's a lot of things that, that, that grab you aesthetically, just uh, you know the, the hologram cranks and the, the, the divot or the hollow section down on the seat stay, for example. Um, great looking bike, too high for me, but uh, I rode it to get a taste of what it was like. Uh, very, very comfortable bike. Uh, I like uh, a lot of things about this, uh, this bike, but not the disc brakes. Um, and uh, I'd love to have a go on one in my size. Um, all in all, uh, glad I had a go on it. And, um, but uh, as I keep saying, I'm not sold on the disc brake concept, as efficient as it may be.